everybody! I'm finally back with a review of a costume because I haven't in a really long time, but I'm back! So, we're gonna review this costume. It's the pink dress from The Little Mermaid, and I bought it off eBay, and it was the really, really cheap version. So I don't know what the quality is gonna be. It's the cheapest version I could find. A lot of people are using the same pictures to display this costume that I wanted to buy, and because I'm cheap, I bought the cheapest one. Now, let's see. It was $70, or $75. It was $75, and I made it tailored to my body. I sent the eBay seller my measurements, and hopefully he did a good job. So, let's open it. It came in a big bag like this. Ugh. It already looks pretty. This is what it looks like so far. I'm ready. My body is ready. Literally. It did not come with a hoop skirt or, um, what are those things called? Like a crinoline skirt that you can put underneath it to fluff it out. But luckily I have both of those. So, this is what the top looks like. It's very pretty. It looks like a satiny, shiny material, which some people in my last review uh, of my Anna cosplay didn't like the costume satin material, but I thought it was very pretty. So it just depends on what you like. And here's the sleeves. The sleeves are supposed to be poofy. And here's this sleeve. It looks a little loose on my arm right here, but that is okay. And there's this thing. We'll see how it really looks whenever I put it on. There's this little jewel right here of a flower and a pearl in the center. And these little um, square things, they are not sewed on. They look like they might be glued on. So it might be good just to watch this, don't touch it as much, to make sure it doesn't fall off. Same thing with the other side. This dress has this material that creates a fake corset looking thing, you know what I'm talking about? The dress is one piece, but it looks like it's two pieces, like a shirt and skirt, yeah, you know, you know. It has this beautiful little sheer material that has these little tiny circles on them that are holographic, and underneath it has this silver material instead of, um, in the movie, the original is white right here, and I really, really, really like the silver material, and the bottom has a really, really nice lace bottom. It's really, really pretty, and I really like it, and the lace is really good material lace. Now, the back of the dress has an invisible zipper. It's white, and see if I can unzip it. It might be a little stuck a little bit at a time. Okay, there we go. It has an invisible zipper. It goes all the way down to your butt. And the back of the dress looks just like the front with the two-parted material, the holographic sheer white material, the lace, and the silver on the under part. Now, the seams on the outside look really nice. On the inside, some parts look a bit loose, like there's some loose strands, and let's see, there's one part, this part. This part looks a little weird, I don't know how to explain it. I'm not a seamstress, but it is a little sloppy, and it does look like it may come out at some point, but for a costume of the price that I got it, I guess that's decent since I did get it at a cheap price. Hopefully it doesn't fall apart on me when I go to a birthday party or something. So in a minute I'm going to try on the dress, but first, I'm going to lay it right there. I'm going to talk about the wig that I got. The wig did not come from the same person that I bought the dress from. I got the wig off eBay as well, but from a different seller. Um, everything that I bought in this video, the dress and the wig will be linked below. This wig 
It's so pretty. It's such the perfect shade of red. It's really heavy and it's really, really thick. And it looks kind of frizzy right now because I didn't have it stored correctly. But it's really nice. It has a skin cap right here. You can't see it because there's so much hair. I got it for $18. Technically $19. It's like $18.99. But it's so long, so pretty, so curly, such the perfect shade of red. The only downside that I don't like about it is there are these little short hairs right here that are just weird. Like it doesn't match the rest of the wig and it's just underneath the bangs. Which I don't understand why they did that, but if you part it correctly, you can kind of hide it against your skin and hide it within the rest of the hairs and just hairspray it really well and it's not going to show up. Other than that, I really, really do like this wig. Now I'm going to try on the dress and show you what it looks like. Overall, I think the dress is really great material. It's made really, really well. It fits my body beautifully. It's tailored to my body. It's beautiful. I love it. I'm so in love with it. The only thing I'm kind of weirded out by is the sleeves. I'm not sure if I like them or not, but I'll figure out what I'm going to do about those later. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to check out the rest of my reviews. Uh, subscribe to my channel for more reviews. I have an Anna Coronation video coming up soon. A review? Come on. Coronation. Frozen. You gotta watch it. It's a review. It's coming up soon. Thank you guys. Bye!